Let's go. A bit of time. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, sorry, I'm just there. Come out neat and tidy. Yeah, she shall come out well. I'm pleased with it. So yeah, if we can explain the gear shift. What I did, the arm that comes down that side, I had it the same length, didn't I? Yeah. So I shortened that down and then extended the rod arm. So instead of having a small bit of movement, now I've got nice park, reverse, neutral, drive. There's a big, big gap in there. Yeah. And I made that, I changed that linkage we were trying to make to a tube. I welded on the side of there with a bolt down it, high tensile bolt. Okay. So that's just your drop off on you. Much better, isn't it? Yeah. So, I made the rear sec, I've got to paint them yet. I made the cherry bombs, the rear sections, and there's a hanger up under there I made on a donut. So that's all good and neat and tidy, and you can see the exhaust headers I made in there wrapped with the heat shield so that they clear everything What car is this? 1947 Buick Series 40 Super. It's original, come from Belgium, I think. Where's Antwerp? Belgium. Yeah. Yeah, just going through it, doing bits that don't work, getting them working. Took the interior out because it was all soaking wet. Done the best I can on the engine with that carburetor on it till we get the new carb. Is there anything major you need to do on it? The biggest pain in the bums are windscreen wipers. Oh. So they all work on cables. Okay. Like push bike cables and it snapped. So I think I'm looking at possibly dashboard out. The bonnet's weird. Obviously it's taken off, but it can hinge that way. So you can undo that side clip and these two hinges will come up like that. Okay. If your bonnet comes up, or you can clamp this side onto that and those hinges will come up. So you can ship the bonnet that way or that way, or you undo both of them and just lift it straight off. Oh wow. Boot lid, not working. Well, it's not latching. It's not doing anything, I don't mean. <clears throat> right, that should be now locked. There's something busted in here, isn't it? Well, something's broken in there, so we'll have to take it apart. If you look at that, look. It's a fisher body, yeah? Okay. Look at the shape of that boot lid. I'm going to look at the back of the Cadillac. All made by Fisher. Yeah, shows, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Even that belt line moulding around there is similar, isn't it? Yeah. The lock works. Right, that's where it's gone. Somewhere in there it's broken. Yeah, it should be bonded to that somehow, I think. So I might have to just drill it and put a pin in there. Where, where do you think it's broken? Where do you think it's gone? Well, that shouldn't turn in there. 
see that bit's lock solid there and you can still turn the handle you see okay if you look at where that lines up all of that it's probably around about there It's hard to know where that was. It's in the boot. Shut up. Right, I can't go any deeper than that. So what's the purpose of that um this what the pin yeah that's the to pin. lock that to that it was bonded originally mm. the bondings come apart or pressed or something so we've gone a bit too far so i just want to pull it out a little bit if possible not quite that much though right let's put one in the other side as well give it a bit more strength that should be deep enough <laughs> Push that lock barrel turns in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. You can't push the pin in too far. Once that's in there, I shouldn't be able to turn it. Let's lock the handle up solid. Which is what we need. Right. Make sure that works in there, which it should do. Right, so now I've got to try and put this back together and get the lock in it, because I can't remember how to do it. I'm good like that. I think they came out that way, didn't they? Right. So that is now open, isn't it? So we need to go that way. Right, and you should be able to turn that, and that won't let you move the hand. It's a job well done, it. Yeah. And you find the key for it. Next week on the workshop. Hold on a second. Unless my eyes deceive me, that looks like a Norton Big Four. Huh? No, you are correct. <laughs>